Welcome, foolish mortals, to another short uh, collection video. Today, we're going to go back. We're going to go back to medieval days and take a look at Kinner's Robin Hood Prince of Thieves figures. Now, these were uh, made for the movie, of course. You couldn't get away from this film. It was a huge hit. Um, you couldn't get away from its soundtrack. Everything I do, I do for you. Um, but the figures were actually pretty decent. They were kind of rehashes of a lot of the uh, molds Kinner had. Um, in fact, especially the vehicles. Uh, you'll notice that all of them are former Ewok vehicles from Return of the Jedi and from the Ewoks television series. So first up, we have Longbow Robin Hood. Robin, of course, played by Kevin Costner. And then there was a crossbow, Robin Hood as well. The great Alan Rickman as the Sheriff of Nottingham with a figure that looks absolutely nothing like him. I mean, his costume's wrong. It's just... It was Kinner. What do you want? But they're three and three quarter inch, and I love them. So, you know... This is Little John with his quarter staff. This is Will Scarlet, played by Christian Slater. And he comes with a crossbow as well, which, you know, he was more of a knife guy. And what would be Kenner without a possibility of an army build figure? This is the Dark Warrior. He comes with a pike. And a nifty hat that he never wore. But this gave you the opportunity to army build bad guys for the Sheriff of Nottingham. Now there were vehicles for this set, of which I believe I own none. Uh, there was a Sherwood Forest playset that is a repackage of the Ewok playset. A Battle Wagon which is also a repackage of the Ewok Battle Wagon. They didn't even change the names, really. A Net Launcher and a Bolo Bomber. Now, the only figure I don't have out here is Azim, who is, of course, played by Morgan Freeman. I do have him. However, I have three or four, and all of the bubbles have popped off. So I don't even have one on card. I have to figure it out and go. Um, one of the other... Last figures is Friar Tuck. Uh, he was a reuse of the um, Gamorrean Guard with a new head. And then when I was working at Toys R Us, we started getting Canadian packagings of these because they sold so well, um, they started shipping these to us. Now, we only ended up getting Robins. Uh, we got whole cases of Robins like that. But it's all... Uh, bilingual packaging. The card design's a little different on the back just to support the different languages. But it was a great little series. Good movie. Um, if you haven't seen it, please do. It's a very, you know, Kevin Costner doesn't even try um, to pull off an accent. So... All right. Talk to you guys on the flip side.